What's up guys, Chris from Closet Weave here and we're back in my closet to watch a new anime. We're gonna be watching Bartender Glass of God. So I watched a, a trailer for this when it was uh, uh, when it was first gonna be when it was first announced this was gonna be released. I know nothing about it. Um, it looks like from the trailer there's gonna be a bartender and then he's gonna meet a bunch of people and we're gonna hear stories from all the people he he serves drinks to so this is something uh i'm not very familiar with i'm not someone who who goes to bars or goes drinking uh, i've been to a few bars in my lifetime and um like i said i don't really drink two shots of whatever is good enough for me to get me uh get me a little buzzed and uh, i only drink on special occasions but this is like uh, uh, going out of my my comfort zone of anime, and who knows? Maybe it'll be a, uh, an anime that that's really enjoyable. And it, it does look like it, it from the trailer. The animation looked really good, um, and I've worked in the uh, food industry, customer service industry, um, a couple times. Worked at a couple restaurants and. Just from those experiences, you're able to hear uh, a whole lot of conversations from a bunch of different people around, coworkers and then customers themselves. And some of those customers become your regulars that you, you are able to have a bond with and uh, gain trust with and able to be honest with until just some some deep stories with each other so i'm assuming that's what this show is going to be about maybe my whole theory is going to get blown out the water but i'm excited to get into it so let's see what happens let's jump into episode one of bartender glass of god a gentle perch oh the ice <laughs> Okay, physician or pharmacist? Bartender. Okay, intro song. Pretty good. Good start, good start. Mm, here we go. The bartender test. The certification. Oh. Gotta wow the judges. <laughs> Martini. Oh, caught him. Zang. <laughs> mark down, mark down. <laughs> Throwing terms at him he doesn't know. Oh. Oh, or just making it really difficult. Oh, we got Mr. Style. Style and flair over here. <laughs> <laughs> Big social media bartender. <laughs> oh, who can make the glass of God? <laughs> what an achievement. Destiny. <laughs> Destiny's calling. Oh. <laughs> or an alarm. <laughs> oh no. Not good with technology. <laughs> Is he not from this world? Oh, 
boy's fast. <laughs> Thirty people have been tested and failed. <laughs> you guys gotta find that bartender. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> The chosen one. The chosen one will make the glass of God. <laughs> the second time seeing this guy? It is destiny. Nope. He moved here. He moved to Japan. <laughs> Beard, like I said, it's fate. Destiny. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Oh. Okay, so he works at Eden Hall. I thought that door that's sealed is Eden Hall. Dang, it's in it's in like the basement of the building. Hmm. Hey, that's that's a that underground underground bar. Whoa. Zayn, the atmosphere, so elegant. Huh? It's you? <laughs> it's like he turns into a whole different, whole different man when he's the bartender. He's not so forgetful. <laughs> No, they're about to just fall in love with his bartending. A towel? No, this dude's too cool. He's too cool. <laughs> He's about to blow him away. <laughs> Oh. oh, watch him, watch him, observe, observe. Zane. 30 seconds. Amazing. Oh, he's asking the questions. Oh. Oh, he's too good. <laughs> he knows. He knows. Your wish will be granted out here by the God. Ooh, 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 the movement, ooh, ooh, ooh. The technique. <laughs> Using his fingers like that. Oh. Sexy. Ooh. Cosmopolitan. Challenge him. You gotta challenge him. Oh, 
Oh, he's got to try and figure her out. Is he going to ask questions? He's trying to get some, get some information out of her? Or is he so good he doesn't even need to ask questions? Ooh. My goodness. The twirling. Excess water out? Not the details. Oh. oh. Surprise, surprise. Ooh, a little lemon with a little lemon squeeze. Nah, but when you drank it at the other bar, you let it get diluted. You didn't even try it yet. Oh, the palette. <laughs> He's too good. What is this? <laughs> wow. Making you go into a memory. A highball made from the god of glass. Mm. Bartender. Damn, he makes medicine for his customers. Oh, this guy, dude is too good. Nah, he pays attention to the little details. Nah, he's too good. He's too clean. He's too good. Because your body is tired and stressed. Oh, <laughs> the ice. <laughs> No, he's the one. He's the chosen bartender. But will he leave this bar? Uh -huh. Gentle perch. Now he takes his job real serious. I don't even remember his name. <laughs> I'm just gonna call him the God. <laughs> now look, look at these two, they're so excited now. <laughs> we gotta get him. We got to. Oh, you forgot to return it? <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> you gotta rack up some library fees. Uh oh. Uh oh. Looking like he got a he got a got a sad backstory. What's going on, man? Hey. Great first episode. I'm interested. So we're following these two women. Don't remember their names. Gonna have to go back and uh uh remember them but they're they're working for this hotel this hotel has a new bar they're trying to find a bartender worthy enough to uh, to work their bar and they tested a few of them in the beginning none of them passed and they were feeling down and out not thinking they won't be able to find one and they kept running into this guy uh, Ryu first on the bench uh, with his bartender book and he looked like a very carefree guy, ditzy guy, forgetful guy. He left his book there and then they ran into him at this late night restaurant bar looking thing. And he was talking to one of the customers, uh, looked like he forgot to forgot his wallet to pay the last time they ate. And then this time when he had his wallet, there was no money in there. He forgot to go to the bank. 
So, like I said, he looked like he's a very forgetful, ditzy guy. And uh, the two women found out there was another, there was a bartender from overseas that, that's here in Japan um, that had some good reviews. And when they went to that bar, looking like an underground bar, Eden Hall, they found that same guy, Ryu. And they, they were testing him uh, at his bar to see if he, he if he's the real deal. Uh, first girl really enjoyed the Cosmopolitan he made her. And then the second girl at first was very disappointed because it looked like he just made a very simple drink and she, she didn't think too much of it. But once he drank it, she just got thrown into a whole um, ecstasy, I don't know, crazy memory or something. Um, but she was feeling really happy, feeling relieved. And she just didn't know why that highball tasted so good. And he explained it. You know, he's a very observant guy. Once he's behind that bar and he, he's in bartender mode, he wants to make sure his customers um, uh, get the best drink possible. And he explained the whole meaning of bartender. And that dude, he takes his job serious. And the two women look like they found their candidate to be their bartender. But now my only question is, is he going to be willing to leave Eden Hall to go to that hotel bar? And it looks like he has some backstory because he was just looking at some empty lot. Maybe there was a previous bar there or he had a lot of memories and while he was overseas, it got shut down or something. But very interesting. Again, like I said, I don't really drink. So uh, this is all new, new to me and learning new things is always fun and animations while he was while he was making those drink look smooth so that's a thumbs up for me uh, but yeah can't wait to see what happens next if you guys enjoyed the video please leave a like comment subscribe and i'll see you on the next one